having some, what do we have in here, Mingyang? We're having banh mi. Banh mi. mi. What do you call? Oh, sorry. Looks good. <laughs> Yummy. Yes, I'm not having the bami tonight. I had McDonald's. I had to go for the safe western. I'm a little, a little bit apprehensive about the uh, spicy food nowadays. So I'm gonna stick with the western for maybe one or two more days. And then I'll get back to Malay and uh, Chinese food. But uh, I think I'll stick off the Pakistani food. It's not kosher. The natives are restless. Sun setting, Mingyang's eating, all is well. <laughs> In our little bit of Chinatown. Okay, so, time we're gonna head back to the hotel and relax for a couple hours. Maybe go out, maybe do a little shopping tonight. I don't know, we'll see. And get prepared for tomorrow for another journey. Okay. Signing off. Travel log. 954632. <laughs> How is it? Really good. Can't see it. Can't see it. Mm -hmm. You got it? Mm hmm. I miss the noodles like this. Yeah? Mm hmm Just like pickles in Korea. Shower again. It's raining again. The rain is back. We had a little bit of a lag in it, but now it's uh, it's come back with a vengeance. No, not really, but we're gonna try to get a taxi after we eat. Hopefully. Alright, talk to you later.
welcome back. Uh, whew, what is it? It is uh, it's Saturday, February 3rd at about 9 o'clock. Uh, Meg and I left KL today around 2 and I went to the Subong airport and she went to the international airport and she's getting ready to go back to Korea so hi Meg I'll see you in a couple days a couple weeks um, I caught a flight from the Subong airport to Kuala Taranganu and I'm in the Seaview Hotel the Coming into the airport, it looked good. It looked really good. It's uh, the airport's just a tiny little. Uh, it's a tiny airport. It's kind of something like Boracay when you fly into near the island of Boracay. So I'm expecting uh, it's going to get a little better. I'm just hoping for some good weather. So tomorrow morning I'll get up, take a look around town, see what it's like. I guess it's a it's mainly a, a Muslim area, uh, so it's pretty quiet. It's not too much happening. So I'll try to find out a bus schedule. Uh, then I'll take a bus from here to going up the coast towards uh, Kuala, Kuala Busut. So it's heading north, I think it is. And from there, I'll try to arrange a, a boat or jetty to Palau Prince and Palau, Palau Kiso is where I want to go so hopefully if it all goes well but I got a little problem with the money I gotta get to a bank tomorrow because I'm out of money and we'll be on our way um, well I'll be on my way me myself and I so now I'm going solo Meg's gone Beth is in uh, Langkawi or she went to Thailand I'm not sure but maybe we'll hook up later I don't know we'll see Kind of ready for a little bit of time, uh, downtime, but for myself, just sit and hit the beach and relax and don't think about anything, just do nothing. Uh, so that's kind of what's happening here, and just kind of getting ready for uh, another little trip. So getting here is good. Hotel, little hotel is sixty, so it's a little cheaper than what we paid on the Cowie. And taxi fare here was a little expensive, but it's nighttime. I don't know the area, so. I was willing to pay an extra, extra five ringgit, ten ringgit, just to get here, and uh, it's pretty good. Uh, I'll see. Uh, that's about it. I'm gonna take a shower, shut it down early, get up early, try to get some cash, and we're gonna get things going, get it rolling, and try to get out to an island. Hopefully by tomorrow night. So. One full day of traveling, should be there. A couple weeks on the beach, hoping for some good weather. And we'll see you soon. Okay, bye-bye.